Okay, um, welcome. In this video, I'm going to show you how to attach a new stretcher coil on a SJT300 CED player. Works on all JK models. Um, this here is the old coil, and this here is the new coil. Comes with the wires already attached to it. I just have to attach my wires to those wires. Now this came out from right here. This little thing that sticks up on the back of it goes through that hole and then it has this cotter pin holding it on. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my new one on and then I'll solder the wires on and then it'll be ready to go. Uh, this is the part number. It's 157983. John at CE Datum. Can I hook you up with that? Um, comes in this cute little RCA box. Adorable. So, if you bear with me a moment, I'm going to attach my new stretcher coil and then I'll show my excellent soldering skills. That's a joke. Alright, so I got it in there and I put my cotter pin on the back to hold it in place. It's not going to go anywhere. It'll move around a little bit on that thing and it'll adjust as you put the uh, stylus in there. So I'm about to attempt my crude soldering skills. I already burned my hand picking up the uh, thing that holds the soldering iron like an idiot. So, prepare to laugh and watch as I fail miserably. I'm just going to try to get a little bit of solder on the new wire. Like Sue. And like so. And then I'm going to attempt to solder them together. Like a soap. And Like a so. Wow, that almost looked like I knew what I was doing. I wonder how horrible of a connection that is. Tried not to burn the plastic. I see I melted just a little bit right there, but not bad. That seems to be pretty good. Alright, so with that done, let's put this beast back together and see if it works. Now, the problem, problem that this little booger was causing is when you play a disc, your picture will wobble left and right. 
So if your picture is wobbling left and right, then that's the culprit right there. And you can test it with an ohm meter. I believe I put instructions in the first video on how to do that. Or a, a voltmeter. But uh, hopefully you uh, didn't laugh too hard at my soldering capabilities and enjoyed my video. Um, yeah, thanks. Bye.